All the poison people are gonna be dead soon enough. Oh, half our team is now dead. Speclad, you are the sole survivor! <laughs> my feelings for this game are just hatred. There's nothing else in my heart. You know, I thought at some point that it might have some redeeming characteristics, but it's about balance, and the redeeming characteristics are not balanced out by how freaking terrible every part of this game is. Another trap. You see the captain of the guard standing before you. Die, scum! He screams as he runs insanely towards you. Captain of the guard. I feel like we just stumbled into, like, the final boss area. He's a master ninja! Run. Oops. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> I pressed run on the wrong keyboard, and that made it, uh, move up. Uh, attack, attack, attack. Uh, what do you think? What do you think? This is obviously bossy. I should be using my spells correctly. Um, Dragon Breath is an attack all. Let's do Spectral Touch. Spato! Yeah, obviously on the enemy. Bard Song 3. Uh, defend. 35. Survivable. Oh. And critically hits him, therefore kills him even though he didn't kill him. Thanks, video game. Nice and fair. I mean, this is a boss enemy, and I can technically revive uh, by getting all the way out of here. So I just want to see what's going on. I'm, I'm gonna continue fighting, I just wanna see whether, like, this is even an approachable enemy, or I need to... Oh, we won, okay, so that's definitely an approachable enemy. I think we just got unlucky there, basically. Cause he got that crit that is, like, instant death, apparently. Uh, Spato! And critically hits it. Ah, but, okay. So critically hit just means kill. Critically hit means kill. Critically hit, you die. <laughs> Seems a bit unfair, but you know, whatevs. <laughs> does he always critically hit? And if he does, what am I supposed to do about it? <laughs> I mean, I guess the answer is revive. I don't know why I'm so opposed to the idea of reviving. Oh yeah, because everything in this game is a massive pain in the ass. And crit- yeah, okay. So he is a so guaranteed death for one of our frontliners. I think we need to accept the fact that we have guaranteed death for one of our frontliners and just spend the cash. That that given that he didn't hurt anyone else, I feel like that's about as well as we could have done here. So I am just gonna GTFO. <laughs> It's the Baron's throne. Who will sit on it? Obviously no one. Why would I sit on it under these circumstances? Don't give me this crap. I just want to walk out of here. Seems to have mostly hurt the white. I don't care. <laughs> Tell the white to sit on it. I think we're allowed to make the white sit on it now that... Now that, uh, you, you mention it. Yeah! Make whitey do it. Damn whitey. The discreet noises, I'm not used to them on C64 emulators, says Jeff in chat. That's why you always turn them on in Vice, because Vice is amazing. And if you have the same childhood memories as me of actually using a Commodore 64, its sounds are so good. Like, the, the sounds of, of uh, Vice, that is. This is right. This is the sounds. This is what it sounds like. It's a very particular kind of nostalgia, though. Oh, now here's a question. Is it going to remake me attack the dragon statue on my way out? That would be a dick move. So probably yes. Ah, the Atari ST. So you knew different disc noises, but still very similar. <laughs> oh, I'm afraid. Don't make me attack the dragon again. I don't want to attack the dragon again. I guess since I'm trying to leave, maybe it'll be okay? Okay, it remembered, it remembered. Yeah, 
is in bad shape. Yeah, he's deceased. 8,100 gold. Didn't even give him his HP back. Didn't even give his HP back. What absolute jackasses. Uh, new order. One, two, six, three, four. There we go. Now let's spend forever healing him up. Uh, I need to make it day. I maybe can even level up. So long as I'm up here on the surface anyway, I may as well do all of this. Oh, you know what? I should not- I should not make it day. I should not make it day. That would be a bad idea. You've missed so much, Specklad. You've missed a lot of quite important things, actually. Um, right, okay. If I go into the guild to make it day, it will also... Uh, ruin everything. <laughs> if I go into the guild to make it day, as well as making it day, it will revive all of the statues I destroyed, including the dragon, which I don't want to happen. So I'm just gonna, like, grind until it's day. Uh, still needs 13. Thousand? That's absurd. Okay. Um. Oh yes, I need to pool my gold into Spec Lad so that he can level up. Uh. Oh God. So he can level up his magic. I just accidentally did fast motion for no reason. Good for me. Have I finished exploring the wine sewer? Asketh Spec Lad. No. I just went wandering somewhere else, which was far more exciting. Seven thousand. I c are you- Because I had to spend 8,000 gold bringing Hoomstendiva back to life, I now don't have- Oh my god, this video game. Sorry, Specklad, looks like you're never going to get more spells. <laughs> ever, ever, ever. <laughs> Dang it, I already destroyed this! Maybe they just always restore the next day. In which case, I may as well just, like, sit here until I at least have my mana back. Because this is dumb. Okay, let's just do all of this nonsense again. The, uh... The, the, the statue and the, yeah, the stone giant and the, the other one shouldn't really be a problem. Hey, wait, I'm going the direction that forces me to go through two statues when I could be going the other way that at least only forces me to go through one. I'm being an idiot. Why is it that this particular area has a two statue path and a one statue path? And also this statue isn't here? I'm deeply confused. What causes the statues to regrow or not? This statue isn't here. I don't understand. <laughs> okay, let's go back into Harkonnen's, I mean Harkin's castle. So, Specklad, how terrible of an idea is it that I'm already going into Harkin's castle? It still says I'm facing west, but I should be facing north. Oh wow, the compass didn't update. That's hilarious. I face everything. Ogre Magi? Ogre Magi? What the hell are Ogre Magi? I don't want Ogre Magi! Oh, I don't have to fight him. Where am I? Okay, there am I. Let me see if I can avoid this trap here. Uh, maybe also mapping while I'm doing it. Maybe also screwing everything up while I'm doing it. Yay, I avoided the trap. Now, here's the real question. When we get back in here, is the guard going to be back alive? Because <laughs> if he is, this has been a colossal waste of time. <laughs> trap. Oh no, we hit a trap. <laughs> they poisoned the white! <laughs> Imagine a world in which I give a shit. <laughs> Don't you do it. Don't you do it, video game! I already killed this guard! This guard auto- hmm. 
I don't think it's possible to avoid this guard killing one of us. I think he always kills one of us. This is excessively annoying! <laughs> oh no! Uh, what was I using? What was I using? Spato! That's right. Oh, when was the last time I got, uh, Mass Dragon drunk? It's been too long. And critically, so instant death. Instant death. I think, given that critical seems to just be unavoidable death, I think that the nature of this boss is just, you will lose a character. You have to continue through here one character short. He will kill a character. I don't think we ever gain a spell where we can bring people back to life, can we? Maybe the wizard does? I don't think so. I'm just going for it. Uh, there's the hell with it. Let's just go straight on. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> oh, everything. What if you fight him while you have a pet? Asks Specklad. Ah, uh, that's a fair point. Technically, the pet could get unlucky and be the one who takes the damage, but, uh... You know what? If nothing else, I'm getting exploration done. <laughs> Level 7 in a, and in a class you don't have. So, let me, while I get killed by this group, describe the, the magic classes for anybody who's watching and doesn't know. Uh, so, you can only start with Conjurer or bleh, Magician. Um, and uh, if you switch spell classes, it's like starting from zero... So, even though you can, there's stairs going up, how interesting. Even though you can uh, switch classes, if you do it before you've actually finished the previous class, then uh, it would take a monumental amount of time to go back and get the previous class's uh, spells up. So, I assume that the right sort of concept is to, uh, is to get everything up, get everyone up to, oh god, what am I trying to say? Get each spellcaster up to the highest level in whatever they start in, and only switch their class then. Also, to become a wizard, which is like the magiciest one of all, you have to finish two of the previous ones. So, yeah, wizards, if, if it's a wizard spell, we are never getting it at all. <laughs> it did say something about two classes, like you need to already have something to do with two other classes. I don't know if you actually needed to finish them, but you definitely need to have something to do with two other classes in order to get uh, wizard spells. At least according to my manual, which is inconsistent with the manual that Speclat found, so right. <laughs> the hell is this big empty chamber? I've already gotten past, like, the stairs. Did I miscount? There wasn't a door on that side. I must have miscounted somewhere. No. And yet... Oh no, the map isn't even consistent! <laughs> oh no! That's just a one-way door. Well, luckily, my map has the ability to represent one-way doors, so no problem. Thanks for not forcing me to attack you. Wow, I can't believe all of these uh, groups are just letting me run away. That seems quite surprising, frankly. Okay, that, that was just wrong. That's not actually there. So many doors to choose from, and I'll bet every single one of them kills you. <laughs> New pet? New pet just dropped! Half-orc? A pet half-orc? He's my dumb shit! Ooh, smoke in your eyes. Okay. So that changed my distance of vision? That seems quite problematic. Yeah. Well, I don't want this crap. How do I unsmoke in my eyes? This is quite bad, actually. This is really limited vision. I mean, I guess for the 
sake of mapping, it's technically sufficient. But it sucks. <laughs> also, I could miss doors, because I won't see them on- Hmm, man. This is garbage. Seven blue dragons! <laughs> yeah, I can defeat those, no problem. That's not blue! Well, I'm dead. <laughs> Uh, cast Dragon's Breath against these dragons. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, doesn't matter what we do, because we're already dead. <laughs> Yay! Go Speckled! <laughs> You've saved yourself! <laughs> I see, the blue dragons are the weakling dragons. Half pet, half orc. He lives in two worlds, but is the master of them both. Yep, that's right. Oh no, you killed my pet. <laughs> God, why does it have to be death by a thousand paper cuts? Spell dragon's breath backwards and cast to the enemy to take away their breath. Oh, of course. There are seven of them. I... <laughs> they let us run. They let us run. Oh, party attack. Attack yourself. Attack yourself. Hey, good job. Good job at killing yourself there. Kyle is surprisingly repell repellent, says Becklad. Good point. Is he the, uh, yeah, he's the, the paladin, so I'm betting that, uh, sort of kind of follows some kind of logic. Is Hoomsnava so weak he can't even kill himself? <laughs> oh, well, nope, nope, definitely not. <laughs> definitely not that. <laughs> oh yeah, continue, please. After everybody else died, the remaining party members just killed themselves. What can I say? Well, there you go. <laughs> video games. We like video games. And we've gone to MacGyver heaven. <laughs> Where did I save? Okay, this is... Uh, if I'm facing east, then that means this is like... Uh, here, I guess. No. No, 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 because I was nowhere near that. Here, it's here. No. This looks very familiar. Oh, this is here. Okay. Yes. Because there was a trap. I healed from that trap. Sure wish I had flags. <laughs> Oops. Let's go down this hall and get killed by everything first. New pet. New pet just dropped. A wandering pet swordsman. But I already have three pet swordsmen, only one of which is dead. <laughs> a pet samurai? That's like a swordsman, but with a bendy sword. That's not what a samurai looks like. It kind of looks like we can go to the right. Maybe I'm misinterpreting? No, we can, we can go to the right. This is an utterly pointless hallway. <laughs> the hell is this about? This is madness. <laughs> You just got a- you've got one hallway full of doors connecting to another hallway with traps in it! <laughs> Who designed this castle? Well, that was a complete waste of time. Luckily, all of the enemies are letting us run. That's convenient. Six spinners, that's quite bad. Uh, let's focus on the eight sorcerers. Uh, and then remember that I only have some of my party members. Cast Dragon Breath on the spinners. Try and get rid of them quickly. Bard Song 3 for lols. Instantly, half our team is poisoned. Van Whitman is dead. Everything's going really well. Um, Samurai's also dead. All the poison people are going to be dead soon enough. Oh, half our team is now dead. Um, oh, all but one of our team is now dead, and Speclad, you are the sole survivor! Congratulations, you did it! I hate this video game. 
<laughs> my feelings for this game are just hatred. There's nothing else in my heart for this game anymore. You know, I thought at some point that it might have some redeeming characteristics, but it's about balance, and the redeeming characteristics are not balanced out by how freaking terrible every part of this game is. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. It's almost like you're not supposed to be in this area, says Specklad, but those spinners are enemies that are supposedly, like, my level. Those are just, like, those are normal. It's the dragons, like, I'm, fair enough. The dragons beat me. I'm in a stupid area. That's my fault. The spinners? Come on. <laughs> Let me guess. There's a hallway through these doors. <laughs> oh, this isn't a hallway. How not interesting. It's just a bunch of, uh, individual closets. That's- that's nice. Oh. Ooh, those two closets are connected to each other. How drastically exciting. What are all of these ninjas, thieves, monks, and jackal wares doing in this closet? <laughs> and do I want to know? And can I say what it is, or would that be a crime? And Van Whitman is dead. You know what? I'm having a having a thought here. Uh, my thought goes something like this. Uh, if I just push back here to here, uh, maybe that's a little bit too early. Uh, let me check whether that's too early. Uh, you're not the one I gave the diamond sword. Crystal sword, rather. Okay, perfect! So, we're just gonna pretend like none of that happened, and this whole area isn't worthy of exploring, because it's not, and we're gonna go back into the horrible wine cellar. <laughs> because I have nothing but hatred for this video game. At least the wine cellar won't kill me quite as fast, maybe. Uh, nope, that's not where I want to go. You face death itself in the form of six... Weasels. No. Okay, let me let me check whether anybody's got some excess crap on them. Look at that. Looping maps. They loop. They're like normal maps, but terrible. Now I'm gonna have to do the rest of this old, of course, because I hate this video game. I weren't even done yet, God. 